Hi everyone, it's great to see you again for another online assembly this week. And I've got to say, I've been really impressed over the last few weeks. I've been watching on Twitter and seeing the different pictures coming up of all the work that you've been doing to support the five to 10K project supporting CFI and all of the work that they're doing in our community in providing food and, and support for people in our community. So you can give yourselves a big pat on the back for all the work that you have done for that brilliant job, really good. But it did get me thinking about food and just how important food is and also how many different fun foods there are around. Now, I was thinking of some of my own favorite foods and I've got a few of them here. I've got probably my all time favorite food, a bit of dairy milk here, but also I love cheese. I love marmalade like that. Um, I love fruit like strawberries and lettuce as well. I really like. And I was thinking, I love all of these different foods, but I wonder if I like them all together. So I thought maybe I should try putting them all together and seeing what it tastes like. And this might be something that you can do at home as well, is trying out some fun foods and see how it tastes. So I've got my butter here. I'll pull that off, pull off the, mm, this is a brand new thing, a butter, fantastic. Pull that off, get the butter straight out the fridge, this butter here, and I'm gonna put some butter onto the bottom of my special sandwich. And of course, each of these different things, I love them all, but they're all different. There's something unique and different about them all. And I'm not quite sure how it's gonna do putting them all together. So, first off, some cheese, because I love a cheese sandwich. So we'll put some cheese in there, my sandwich, just like that. And, Oh, we of cheese because mm, cheese is great. And then, well, how about a bit of dairy milk to go inside my sandwich? Rawr. Ah. Just like that. I will mm, break it up, put some in just like that. Nice. That is looking good. So I've got cheese and chocolate. It, Sounds like it should go together really well, doesn't it? Extra bit of cheese right there. Um, so I think some strawberries to go inside because chocolate and strawberries is a fantastic combination. So I don't see why chocolate, strawberries and cheese shouldn't be a really good combination as well. So I'll put that in there just like that and uh, slice that up a little further, go inside. Mm, mm, mm. This is looking fabulous. Um, some lettuce because some nice iceberg lettuce, all good sandwiches have a bit of lettuce in them. So we'll put some lettuce in there. So I've got chocolate, I've got lettuce, strawberries and cheese, a little bit extra. In fact, let's just shove it all on. It's fantastic, just like that. And one of the things I love in a sandwich, particularly a cheese sandwich, is a bit of pickle just like that so i think i'm going to open this up get a bit of branston pickle shove it on there like that pop that over there and spread that on ooh, 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 ooh that is looking fine it smells absolutely brilliant and i think on top of the sandwich i love some mayonnaise so a bit of mayonnaise to go on the sandwich as well. Oh, I'm running out of mayonnaise. This is not a good scene. Technique is everything. Oh yeah, look at that. Fantastic. Mayonnaise, pickle, lettuce, strawberry, chocolate, and cheese in my sandwich. But you know what I also like? Marmalade. I think a bit of marmalade to go in there as well. So let's get this spoon for the marmalade 
<laughs> nice bit of marmalade. We'll pop that on there with the pickle because pickle and marmalade sounds like a fantastic combination right there. And we will spread this on. Oh yeah, that looks fine. That looks fine. Just like that. All right, here we go. Pickle and marmalade onto the mayonnaise with the lettuce, with the cheese, with the chocolate and the strawberries. Lettuce is trying to escape, shove it back in. And I'm going to try cutting it now because this is a proper sandwich, this one. No messing around. Oh, that looks fine. Here we go. Open it up. Chocolate, strawberry, lettuce, pickle, marmalade, mayonnaise, butter. Now, how do you think it's going to taste? Let me try and see. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. 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 Oh, mmm. 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 Hey, that is pretty good. Mm, 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 mm. The chocolate is quite chunky in there. I think I'm onto something here. This is great. The strawberry and the chocolate, fruitiness, the sweetness, the marmalade. We've got the mayonnaise. We've got the chutney there. Give a little bit of bite there. We've got the lettuce, nice bit of freshness there. Lovely bread. This is the best sandwich, I think. I have ever created. Now it's over to you. What kind of sandwich can you make out of some of your favorite foods? You know, the sad thing is that in some parts of the world, folks really struggle to get food. And indeed, in parts of our own community, that can be the same for some people that really struggle to get the food that they need. We might have lots of fun foods that we can enjoy just like these, but not everyone does. And every little thing we can do to help kind of even things out, to make the world a more fair world for everyone is a really good and positive thing to do. You've been doing a bit of that yourselves and it's something at the church that we try and do too. It's really important. So have fun, enjoy your own food and whenever we can make a difference for other people, try that. Right, I'm gonna have another bite. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That is good. Emma, you want to try a bit? No, I'll say not. <laughs> Today's song is a song from Fishy Music called Why, which we know well. If you remember the actions for this one, when we get to the, uh, the kind of question bit, it says, can anybody give me an answer? We do like a question mark for that. So can anybody give me an answer? Can anybody give me an answer? And then the chorus goes, why? Oh, why? I'm asking, please, will you tell me why? Why? Oh, why? I'm asking, please, will you tell me why? Okay, let's join and sing this song. You can do the actions with me as well. Why does time go quickly when you're having fun? And why does time go slowly when you're having none? And do I have to do it now? I'd so much rather play. And why can't every day be just like Christmas Day? Can anybody give me an answer? Can anybody give me an answer? Why? Oh, why? Please will you tell me why, why, oh why, I'm asking please will you tell me why. Hey, 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 
Why do chips and sweets taste so very good? And why do adults spoil it and call it junk food? And do I have to go to bed? I want to watch the telly. I don't want to have a bath. I don't mind being smelly. Can anybody give me an answer? Can anybody give me an answer? Why? Oh, why? I'm asking, please, will you tell me why? Why do some have so much, while others none at all? Why are some so hungry, while others have a ball? Why are some so healthy, while others are so ill? Why are some so loving, while others want to kill? Can anybody give me an answer? 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 Please, will you, please, will you, why? Oh, why? I'm asking, please, will you tell me why? Have a great week, everyone, and I'll see you next week. Bye.